While selling on Amazon, it's super, super important for you to maintain the health of your Amazon account. Because if the health of your Amazon account will be poor or at risk, then Amazon can suspend your account no matter how many sales you are getting. So it is super, super important to take care of the health of your Amazon account. And in today's video, I'm going to be discussing this topic in detail. That what can be the reason due to which you can get the copyright infringement and what are the best practices that you can do to avoid that and if somehow you get the copyright infringement from any other seller, then how you can appeal Amazon with evidence to remove that infringement from your account and make the health of your account very good. So watch this video till the end because this video is going to be super super helpful for you as I'm going to be showing you each and everything step by step. But before getting started, I'm Uzair and I sell my products on Amazon, eBay, Shopify, ClickFunnels and Redbubble. And on this channel, I share my experiences of online earning with the people like you so you can do the same and make some money online. So if you are new here, then make sure to like the video and subscribe to the channel as well to watch more videos like this and make some money online. So without any further delay, let's start the video. So as you can see here on my computer screen that this is one of my account and on this account this was my product that was selling very well and you can see that there are 984 units currently available for this product at Amazon Warehouse. But suddenly one day I got the email and that email says that a seller claimed that I am using his content on my listing that's why he put the copyright infringement on my listing and you can see that my detail page has been removed by Amazon. So this listing is no longer available on Amazon for selling. So first of all let me tell you the reasons that what can be the reason that you can get the copyright strike. So you can get the copyright strike if you copy the content of some other sellers to your listing like title, bullet point or description or you copy the images, videos of any seller to your listing images, to your listing video or you can copy the EBC content or A plus content of some other seller to your listing or if you copy the logo or the brand name or the packaging design of any other top seller. So this can be the reason if you use any of these things in your listing then your listing can be suspended. But sometimes you can get the copyright strike without doing anything as here in my case. In my case, I have wrote the description, the bullet point and all the content of this listing by myself and for the photos and for the packaging, we have shoot the photos of this product by ourselves in our studio but still, someone has claimed that we are using that content. So what next? How can we counterfeit that claim? Because that's a wrong claim. So we have to tell Amazon that this content is 100% belong to us and we are the copyright owner of this content and that seller has put the wrong claim to our listing. So for that, we have to go to inventory, manage inventory and we can see that product here and from there we can see on the right side we can click on that drop down menu and we can click on that fix issue so that feature navigate us to the page where we can see that why we got the copyright strike and how we can counterfeit that so you can see there the account health is at risk so there are three colors red yellow and green if that account health is green that means it's good and if that account health is yellow, that means the account is at risk. And if it's poor, that means you are very near to account suspension. To change this health from yellow to green, we have to click on that feature appeal. And then we have to provide the proper documentation, proper evidence that this product belongs to us. For example, if you write the content by yourself, so you can just send them or show them the copy, the word file or the PDF file and the Helium 10 uh, keyword research report that we have done the keyword research by ourselves and wrote the content by ourselves and put that uh, on the listing. Or if the copyright infringement is uh, uh, like on your images, then you can just show Amazon some photos during the photo shoot or some unedited photos. So that will be the strong evidence for uh, your product to Amazon because when Amazon see that you have shoot the images of this product by yourself then Amazon will remove that copyright strike from your account within 24 hours. And if you wanted to know more about copyright infringement and the terms and policies so you can click on that copyright infringement tab and you will be navigated to this page intellectual property for rights owners. So when you scroll down here so you can read all the possible ways from which you can get a copyright strike like you can see that if you use a trademark name of any uh, product so you can get a copyright strike if you uh, use some copyrighted content copyrighted images or if you use some patented product like if the product you are selling is already having a registered design patent in US or UK so you cannot sell that product so make sure to uh, read this whole page before start selling on Amazon so you can avoid getting the copyright strikes in future but for now, if you wanted to remove that copyright strike and make your listing available again, so you have to click on this button appeal 
And from there, you can see that there are three steps. Number one is corrective actions, like you have to tell Amazon what will be your next action if you wanted to remove the copyright. So here you have to explain all the story, like if you got the copyright strike on the images, so you have to explain in detail who is the copyright owner of that images and you have shooted all those photos by yourself. So you have to explain here in detail and when you click on next, you will be navigated to the second page which is add documents. So here you can just add any document like text document or JPEG file or PDF file which act as a supported document of your case which will make your case more and more stronger. And as per my past experience, whenever I attach a strong evidence document with that page, so I get my listing activated again in next 24 hours. So after attaching your document, you will be navigated to the confirmation page and from here you can submit the appeal. And when you will submit that appeal, you will get the email from Amazon that we are reviewing your application. And if your application will be having strong evidence, then we will be reinstated or we will active your listing in next 24 hours. And if your evidence will be strong enough to support your case, then you can see your listing will be active on Amazon in next 24 hours. So that's it for today guys. I hope you enjoyed the video and if you have any question about this, you can just ask me in the comment box below. And if you wanted to learn more about online selling, that how you can sell your physical product, your digital product or promote someone else's product to get commission and make a lot of money online, so you can just subscribe my channel because I have made many useful videos on my past experience of online earning to provide that knowledge to you guys. And you can also check out the description of my video because every time I put very useful link so that can help you a lot to start making money online. So let's meet you the next video. Till then, take care. Bye.